Hey, it's me, Pro Jared, and this is The Crystal Project. This wasn't actually a game that was on my radar at all until you guys, thanks to several people in the comments mentioning if I have seen this game yet, and I took a look on it and I said to myself, oh, oh yeah, I need to know this game. So let's get in there. So for those of you who don't know what this game is, um, it's essentially Final Fantasy, but also a Metroidvania, but also still a platformer. So we got, ooh. Oh, we can change our class. Okay, uh, name? Do, should we just bring them, bring them all back? Peeb the warrior? Yep. Number two? Well, obviously we want a rogue, so. Yep. Oh, you'd love to see it. Oh, it's already so good. Get sure the rogue. Um, what are my other options we got? Monk, cleric, wizard, warlock. Okay, so white mage, black mage, red mage, and monk. Well, obviously. Ian. And finally. Oh, what you're saying? There's actually a difference between male and female? Male is slight boost to hit points, healing power, and luck, whereas female is MP accuracy evasion and speed. That's the same when on other classes. It is. Interesting. Huh. Whatever. And joof. Hell yeah. Start with normal. So this is my first time actually playing this game. Like I literally just installed the game, started it up, and here we are. So I'm going into this the same as you. I seek adventure, but I don't seek to have it handed to me. Adventure is about not knowing what troubles will come and not knowing how to overcome them. If the right path is always clear and the possibility of failure is absent, is it really an adventure at all? Welcome to the spawning meadows. Yeah, so that is very voxel. Hello there, lad! It fills me with joy to see that you've joined us in the land of Sequoia. I assume that you've come seeking adventure. Well, naturally, you've come to the right place, but you look positively famished, as if you're about to be dry up and blow away. I invite you to come pay a visit to our lodge for a big helping of stew. There's nothing like a hearty bowl of stew for an empty stomach. Okay. All right, to the lodge. Just follow this path until you're there. You can't miss it. This looks pretty. So the big thing is that there is platforming, so you can jump around as much as you want. And they make it so that one treasure. Tonic, yes. There's no invisible walls or anything, so like you can probably do some like crazy jumps, like eh, 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 eh. Where am I going? Who knows? Hi squirrel. Acquired a black squirrel. Hey little squirrel. Hey little squirrel. Hey, little squirrel. Hey, little squirrel. Ah, Don't forget to stop and smell the roses along the way. You never know what you'll discover. Is there a, um, change leader button? Do you want me to literally smell the roses? Oh, hello. You don't love one child more, you just love your children differently. Oop. Damn. You're all named Nan? Is this your first time seeing a flame? Is this my safe point? Ah! Oh, no. Okay, welcome to the battle screen. Uh, trickery, steal, do that. Oh, it definitely doesn't have anything, oh well. <laughs> oh look, you can see at the bottom, the turn order, you'd love to see it. Got. Ooh, it's getting ready to attack Peeb. So I do like this, that they, another big thing they saw, they said on the buy screen is that there is no hidden information, which is really cool. Mmm, experience. And a money? Is LP like my job points? You defeated it. Excellent work. Boink, boink, boink. This is really cool. And chill. We must all pause every now and then and take in the beauty which surrounds us. Can I jump on your head to get somewhere? Oh, I can. Oh my god. Oh my god. Secret? 
Eh. Oh, that's fine. Ha! Yee wee! Look, I'm up here now. Found Phoenix juice. That's probably my Phoenix down, huh? There's sparkly up there. Ah, more enemies! Come here! I like how there's no random battles, as you can see, everyone. 60%. Oh, this guy. Oh, so interestingly, enemies don't always have an item, but you might. Yeah, still a tonic. You'd love to see it. You have 50 hit points. Okay. Down to 15, which means one more stick bunk will kill you. All right, Juve, what do you got? Fire! Oh, insta dead. Those are... The pixel graphics look pretty good. Level up! Drops and stolen stuff. Three tonics. And a treasure? Ten more gold. Or copper? Might be copper. Be nice to people on the way up, as you will meet them on the way down. <sighs> Damn. <laughs> I like that. That's, uh... The more you think about it, the deeper it is. Come here, you! Oh, they shipped over him! That was awesome! Ooh, hello. Spooky ghost. 40% chance to steal from the wisp? I'll go for it. Quinn steal. Well, now I'm curious about what you have, so we'll keep you around so I can steal from you. Bonk. Uh, stick. We need to get Juve a knife, that's for sure. Oh, you cure? That's cute. Give me your stuff. Yeah, dang it. Come on, 40% chance. That's practically 100% chance. Just give it to me. Stick it! Nice dodging, Juve. Seal! Tincture! Magic point restoration. Yeah. I even, so I got, between my stop drops and my steals, I got two tinctures. Dude, this is gorgeous. And place is smooth? Can I go this way? Ah! Oh, oh, I can. Just don't heck it up. Oh, and I found a treasure. It's like they knew. Yeah. Yeah, dead. So you charge action points each turn for a special ability, I assume. Wait, I don't think this takes any AP. I'm just gonna kill him. Bonk. Victory! Level up! Really goes to a cedar staff, okay. Who wants a staff? You use a short staff, so therefore a cedar staff gives you more attack and six more spirit. Um, and you can't wear it, so that's just a cleric upgrade. There you go, Ian. You're welcome. Head, body, two accessories, passives. Must first. Oh. Oh no, the job points is a skill tree. Uh oh. So what's my first rogue ability? Eye gouge, single target dagger skill, 23 damage, always misses if you're not the target's bottom threat. Ooh, so I have to have like the lowest threat on him. The blinds him for turn. Backstab. Shadow cut. Generates no threat. Oh, so there's like a, th there's a threat thing? Ooh, girl. Okay. That's pretty exciting to see. Is there fall damage? Maybe not from there. Who knows? Old Nan's watering hole. Oh. There's our save point. Yeah, save the game. Hello. This floating cube right here is a home point. You may set a home point. Oh. Yeah, do that. Uh, I guess it's already done. Hey, other rogue. Man, it's just all Nan's in here. Welcome to old Nan's knickknack shop. Oh, there we go. Short sword, dirk, rapier, short staff, ash wand, buckler, chain helm. There we go. So there's a couple of equipment upgrades. So we can get a chain helm for Peeb. 
I have 30 copper. I better spend it wisely. Another cap. Two hemp woods. I can afford three things. One chain helm. I'll go two hoods. Uh, have a head armor. Pink. Stat changes plus 12. That's like doubling their defense. Gosh dang. All right. You have a slightly different color robe. Spirit being with ingredients is a secret to happiness. Crafting? Oh boy. Don't forget to learn new abilities. Oh, I want that. Acquire the spawning meadows. Oh, a map. Good. Dude, this is really cool. I'm into this. Again, this is available on Steam. It came out the end of March. It's only like 15 bucks, less than that. Uh, so far, this is super cool. Very slick. Oh, look at the map in the lower right now. So would I have like a map screen button or... Okay, not that I can tell. Well, let's just kind of keep exploring around. Treat others as you wish to be treated. Find your passion and make it real. My passion is treasures. Don't look at the calendar. Just keep celebrating each day. Just go ahead and live the way you want to live no matter what. Why is like all these like super nice messages are in here? A lot of like self-affirmation. Honestly, I appreciate it. Welcome to Lende. Should I be here? I like the music credits popping up. Hello. Oh my god. Big ass squirrel. Terrifying carrot. Carrot. Nut muncher? Yeah, you gotta die first. How tough are you? Like, if I stay here, will I die? Bonk. No, he's almost dead. Alright, we're okay. Oh! Wait, what am I doing? Steal. 100% stand steal your nut! Gimme! It's for your nuts! They're mine now! Hee <laughs> hee! I hate this carrot eyeball. Burn! Eh. Crit! Victory! Whoop. There we go. So we all just got a LP. So now we can all get abilities. Learn. A warrior ability. Okay. So he knows taunt. It's 500 of threat. I can give him defender or a berserker. Stance change does not use the turn. Deal more damage, take more physical. Press him down the equip axe. Tree, Blitz Crush, Battle Crush. Okay, that's all cool. Or I can go him down this way, which is the equipped sword tree. Peeb's always been more of a sword guy. He likes being very paladin-y. All right, so now you know Defender. So... He hasn't learned a passive yet. Do you need to equip it? Okay, no. All right, whereas I learned... Backstab, obviously. I want that. What's below that? Equip dagger, regardless of current class. Oh, so the little diamond guys are passes. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, Ian, you know cure. You can learn mend. Kiren, or you can learn spark shine, which allows you to deal damage. Ooh, there's rays though. Uh, let's just get you a spell. Joof. Bolt. Initial focus. Equip wand. Tight. That's cool. I like the job system stuff. Hello? I want that. How much jumping do I gotta do to go get that? Looking like a lot. Or maybe not as much. Hold on. Start from here. Go all the way around this way. Can I make this jump? Eh. I can, good. Up this tree branch, open over, boom, treasure. An earring, what'd you do? Gets four more magic points. Bonus is doubled when paired with another earring. Ha <laughs> ha, just like in Final Fantasy VI. Uh, who needs more magic points? Probably Juve, because all his 
Magic shooting. There you go, my dude. You're welcome. Check my other buttons here. Dude, this is cool. I'm into this. I'll probably play this at least for a solid few episodes, and then we'll have to see from there. La 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 la. Oh! Alright, so I cannot back up because I do not have 10 AP yet, but I can just straight up steal your nut. Mine? I have nothing else I can sell your nuts. Um. Eh. They have a lot of hit points. Whoa, bolt! 69! Nice! It does also tell you how much damage you're gonna do. 17 damage with a 33% chance to crit for 23. Cool. I'm digging that. Oh, didn't mean to bolt again, but there we go. Yay! More job points, please. Thanks for the nuts. Oh, the nuts do heal. Okay. I feel like I should have like a real map button. I probably don't have a map for this area. Hello. But also hello. Look at that treasure. Eh? Oh! Yes! You'd love to see it. You can like jump higher than you'd think. Iron sword! Look, peeb, you're welcome. Plus 21 more attack. Boom, huge upgrade. Are you friendly? Hey, I'm Astley. Are you new here to the land of Sequoia? You look like you just arrived. What made you decide to come? Adventure level 12. Everyone who comes here is looking for something. So what is it you're after? Adventure. I think you've come to the right place. Lots of folks come here seeking adventure. Just be careful of some weirdos who might get on your case if you don't go find crystals every now and then. Which reminds me, you should have this home point stone. I think you'll find it handy. You can use home point stone as many times as you want, whenever you want to go back home. Tight. Appreciate it. Any other treasure? Tonic. Pouch is full, sent to lost and found. Okay, so I do have a maximum inventory size for stuff like that. And it's far less than 99. Hi there. I have not stolen from this carrot yet. Yet. Mm. Secret veggie! Shh, don't tell nobody. But the secret is carrot. So now Peep can hit for 51. Mm. Burn! Ow. How do I see the threat meter? Uh, backstab? Uh, that said zero, so I'm... Oh, you know what? I'm getting a little low. Here, have a cure! Nice. Juf with the crit! So now, still at zero. Only hits when bottom of threat. How do I be a bottom threat? That's what he said. Yeah. Okay, I haven't quite figured out how to see the threat meters. Level up! Nuts, tinctures, and another and a veggie I stole, plus some more money. The Salmon River. East is the Proving Meadows, northwest is the Fish Hatchery. Fish Hatchery? That sounds neat. Another tink drawer hidden right there by that tree. Speaking of tree, can I climb you? And then leap! I'm the best. Oh, many dudes. Uh, get them. Uh, eh? Got one. All right, Juve, can you multi target yet? Does not seem to be a thing. Burn! Oh, yeah, that definitely made Juve a threat. Oh, so much to kick the crap out of him for it. Oh. Oops, didn't mean to target that. 
Also, watch out because sometimes this game will get secretly brutal and I don't have rays. Okay, mistakes were made. Heal! Ah, oh, my nuts got crunched. Uh, spark shine. Ooh, that looks nice. Ah, why is everyone going for my nuts? Crit. Big hit. Just slap them. Victory! Oh, oh, Joof still gets the experience. Oh, he gets less. Okay, that's generous. Still, still, still dead though. What we got? Maybe another ability. Oh, so you gotta learn up. Oh man. So if I want to, I can learn Shadow Cut. Target cannot counter generates no threat. Always misses if you're not the bottom threat though. Yeah, just haven't quite figured out all that stuff. We'll get there, though. All right, Ian, we're going to start having you learn towards race. It turns out that's important. Joof, do you want to learn uh, firing and bolt? No, ice? Is that a different class? Does a warlock have ice? Scan, heal, protect, blaze? Wee. Remedy, life? Wait, so life revives a target. How is that different than raise? Oh, it's a little bit stronger of a ray spell. Fascinating. Okay. Well, man, 20 money. I want to get Juif back. But I also made all this progress. I don't want to have to start over. Unless this is it. Whew. I'll just try my best to avoid battles and see if there's any more treasures I can get. Where am I? There's the pathway, so I must be back on, like, the right direction. Who wants to do that? Secret treasure! Cotton Hood! Uh, here, Joof, you can have it since you died the most. Ooh! Piercing resistance? Last data ups? There you go. Oh, I didn't see you there. Ah, oh, heck. Uh, there is not a run option, so I guess we're doing this. <laughs> Defender doesn't like generate more threat or anything. I can taunt individual targets. I think we're okay for now. Yeah, just kill one. Peck. Attack. 69? Oh, and they both pissed at me. Uh. Don't. Don't. Uh, cure? Don't die! Woohoo! Good dodge. Ouch. Right, I think Peep can finish off the squirrel with his attack. Yep. And then I can start focusing on... Oh, he's gonna do, like, a spell soon. Uh, take this! Spark shine in your eyeball! Seer? Ooh. No. Oh, I crit to finish him. I still feel like I'm hitting him with just a stick. Level up! Hello. Oh, bye. Grotto encampment, proving meadows, treasure. No. Eh. No. Eh. No. Eh. Wait, huh? Eh. There we go. Fifteen money. Hello, new friend. Hi, Chloe. I'm Chloe. I came to the land of Sequoia to make friends. Maybe you'll be one of them. Oh, oh, there's a whole mess of people down here. Maybe just found another town. Get back here, you little twerp. I'll report you. I found this stupid ring. This guy is so jealous. He's gonna report me. I don't even want to take it. Yes. Stuff. Care to buy some items? Uh. Oh, I had Phoenix juice, didn't I? I could have used that the whole time on Juve. Whoops. Oh well. Ooh. 
There we go. Some new weapons. Some new armor. More importantly, home point. Um, set home point. Template. New. Oh, she can like save their current loadouts. Neat. Healing is hard to combine. Here. Yes, I'd like to purchase your healing. Oh, it's like the inn. Hmm. Thanks, Doc. You're a lifesaver. Looking for crystals is tough work, and I can't keep trekking back to Nans every time I get hurt. S same. I, we can go to that spooky cave next. All right, let's buy some items. I already got... I only have 91 money. So I don't really need new weapons for these guys, because who cares? But I would like more steppers. Throw that on me right away. So that gives me 18 more attack. And then apparently I need armor. Stout shield. Reduces evasion. Sturdy helm. Ringmail. Beret. Studded armor. Plus 7 attack from the armor? Cotton armor. I don't have a hat on at all, so this is just 25 more armor compared to... Yeah, this is just like 11 more armor versus the hat, which is straight up 25 more. Crit damage bonus plus 10. What if I just bought both things for me? Hmm? What if I did? What if I did as a little treat for me? I got this hat and this armor. I can sell my old stuff. Uh, old Dirk, sell. Sword, sword, sell. Staff, sell. Armors, don't need that, don't need that. See, so you got 22 again. With 22, I can buy absolutely nothing. What about those nuts? Value zero? I guess they only heal 20 hit points. I was stealing them so I could sell them. But now they're not worth anything. Oh, what's this fervor charm? Plus one AP when using a basic attack. Ooh, okay. Let's actually throw that on me. Hell yeah. All right, now I can go to the ground next. This is really cool. It plays so smooth. The, like, it's very Final Fantasy uh, inspired, absolutely. The battle system around more more something like Bravely Default 2, where you can see the turn order and the threat and all that. But like, this plays so cool. I actually like the platforming, the searching around. And like, I have so many directions I can go. I am fascinated by this. Uh, let's do more episodes. But this is cool, right? Not just me. I'm into this. As always, thank you guys so very much for watching. See you next time.